Ladies and gentlemen, it's June the 7th, and tonight, live from the Medi Center in Atenisa Biome, it's the June Base Race. Hello everybody, are you having fun? I hope you are. Right, let's get on with it as normal. I'm not going to spend too much time here because this is time that we don't want to lose. We need to get going. Right. And we need to go. I am sorry, I apologize um, to Techner who put this build together and Ed who moved it into here. And there's a creeper in the pond, and but I'm going to get moving ooh, as fast as I can and go to some trees. Is that a long way away? This might all be a long way away. There's some trees here. <laughs> Don't think I'll go for those. <coughs> this is. A very big mesa biome, and I need to get some things done. Ouch, and I need to hurt myself apparently. There's some wood inside here somewhere. There we go. Down we go. Actually, I haven't started my timer, have I? <clears throat> I'll add a little on to that from the moment I left the base. Okay. So, it's a musical theme. I'm dressed for the part, but I'm not going to be, despite the intro, I'm not going to be acting my way through it. Um, life's too short. I've got too much to get done. There's squid there that I could do with, but I really need to get myself to somewhere where I can get food. I think it really was a long way away where I was heading for. Yes, this Mesa goes on forever. Possibly not the best direction to have headed in the first place, but I realised where a couple of people had already gone at the start. They'd gone another way. Oh, this really is bad. Huge ravines cutting their way through here. Now, I didn't want to go anywhere where I'd already seen where various items might be. So I headed this way. Um, yes, we're going to need lots of stuff. Some of that clay, of course. There seems to be quite a lot of underground activity in this one, but there's some surface stuff as well. really need to get to. Right, I would like to get to somewhere where I can see stone. <laughs> but, um, first of all, I don't want to starve to death and there's always this possibility when you head off across the desert. Well, it's not desert really, but it's deserted in terms of food. So is there actually stone underneath these things? I wonder if I got myself a... Look, mushroom. Well, I'll take that. This 
This is a dreadful place, isn't it? I really should have gone the obvious way. But, hey, why do the obvious thing when you can starve? Get reborn. Right, well, there's my stone. We're only, we're only coming. We're still morning. We haven't even reached midday. We're going to need a lot of cobblestone in this one. Okay. So. Let's put together the basics. There. And that can get out of there as well. And that and that. This can stay down here. Um, I need to be doing some shopping, so I'll do that as well. Good. Right. Take that with me. Just grab a few more bits of the cobble. But it's going to be food hunt time immediately. I also need lots of coal. Coal is something that we we need tons of in. See the sun's getting low already. Still the possibility I will start. Somewhere this biome must finish, but will I get? Oh, it doesn't. It still doesn't finish. It's just ridiculously huge. Ah, right. Let's trundle my way down here. Oh, I've seen an animal. I'm also going to be, I realise, so far away from the base. This was this was such a bad idea. As I'm sure everybody will tell me. Shouldn't have done that. But you live and learn, or you live and die. Right, so we've now reached a place of trees. And still no animals, but perhaps perhaps an apple will drop. I do need a fair number of logs just for the the collection. Realise that making my way back home is going to take like forever. Unless I've learned to fly by then. <clears throat> so, seven minutes in. Not an animal, not an animal in sight. Come on. <sighs> Do animals not actually arrive in? Oh, I'm up on the Mesa Plateau. I assume it's probably a bad place where you never get any animals. Probably get bad mobs though. Well, wow. 
and night is coming. Right, I'm pretty sure I'm going to die one way or another. That's probably going to be my way of getting back to base. So we'll just call it a, a day wasted completely and uh, and probably this was not the way to go. Maybe if I just jump, then I will have only wasted 10 minutes. about 120 miles away from um anywhere oh look let's let's just go for death hello hi good right so let's come back to here again Right, well that was a complete waste of time, wasn't it? So let's sleep, make it morning, and I'll go somewhere else. Goody good. This is the way we like to play these. Um, I can hear mobs outside burning up, or not. There's various mobs out there. Right, let's get started all over again. And food are going to be my first needs. I'm wondering whether it's helped me at all the fact that I've just thrown away 10 minutes. I mean, 10 minutes is not that big in, in terms of one of these challenges. It usually takes me about, I suppose, two and a half hours is my average. quick time once, but in terms of that, 10 minutes is a fairly small proportion. So, what, 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 um, it's the stone just up there, isn't there? I feel like I've done this before. Right. Okay. Probably ought to teach me to make one more set of sticks each time as well, because I need to do that both times. usually start them off with such high intentions and ready for a, 
a good gallivant around on a, on a run and it usually ends up with me doing something so stupid very early on that I end up having a very I don't know, quiet time where I'm ruining my mistake. Oh look, Moo. First animal I've seen. Right, where's your mates? Oh look, I can still see, see the um, meditation centre over there. Right, so it seems as though it was a cow alone. Not a friend in the world. Chicken! Gone. Ah, you've got friends. Look, there's brown mushrooms to go with that red mushroom that I had in a former life. Alright, oh, there's another cow right down there. So... Let's get my head back on it. It's, it's strange how completely failing to survive has taken my mind off of what I was really attempting to do. I had such plans. I'm sure I had such plans, but I can't remember them now. Um. Yeah, I guess if I make sure I've got... Oh look, I can kill those squid, get some black stuff. Die, die the local sheep population. And, um... Except there are no local sheep population. I didn't see any in the direction I headed either, so... When Ed says they're difficult to come by, then... He, uh, he evidently doesn't mean over in that direction. Okay. Um, I was actually going to... I think food is obviously one thing which I had pointed out to me very clearly I needed. We need absolutely masses of cobblestone. Probably something like... 300 stacks or something. Let's, let's just get a few and cook them up. I can even run back to base and cook them up. Because 40 of them have to be turned into smooth stone. But, of course, saying cook them up makes me think I do need that black stuff that you cook things with. Yes. Koala. Right. So. Um, while I'm here, let's just pop one of those down. Make a simple one of these. Um, I do need plenty of wood, although I seem to remember there's an awful lot of spruce that we need. And there's some oak. I have to find an oak somewhere. Around here it's nothing but birch. Okay. Something to eat. There's also 
um, the other thing about Base Race that I find is in the early stages I just go out there and collect and collect and don't think about what it is that I'm trying to to make at all and it only as the you know sort of episode six seven eight come up then I start to think what am I actually collecting for what is it I've got to put together but I guess that's just my my aging mind Do I want to kill more cows? Not bother. I've got some food. That'll, that'll keep me happy. There we go. <clears throat> Well, we're just coming down to the end of the first 20 minutes. I hope you found that entertaining. I'll stand here and say goodbye to the sun and say goodbye to the audience at the same moment. Right, this is Bat Heart signing out. That's the end of one episode of Base Race. Bye-zee-bye. -bye.